everybody walking back outside. We got Dawn showing herself in the background. I heard my son doing a little bit of speckle trout fishing this morning in one of the local honey holes. A lot of boats going by. There's a tournament going on today. We're not in it. We're just doing some bait fishing. We're going to be trying out the Z-Man jerk shads today, 4 inch and 5 inch. With the Z-Man uh, finesse bullets and see how it works for speckled trout. Let's get the fish. So I'll see if we can get one here on the four inch Z-Man uh, minnows and bad shad. And finesse bullets is what the hook is. One fifth ounce. Well, I'm getting some bumps, but we'll get them. Yeah, I have a feeling. Yep, there it is, hooked up. Cast that Z Man uh, jerk shads out there, four inch and bad shad, with a Z Man one fifth ounce finesse bullets. That's what it's rigged on. First cast, sparkle trout right away, little ones. Hopefully, that's not all what's in here today. See you, dude. Just letting it go to the bottom. Just doing a twitch, let it settle on the bottom again. A couple twitches. Got a falling tide. Which is ideal. Yep, there we go for this side of the bridge. Well, yeah, that's another speck. Make this another throwbacker. Another throwbacker. Um, look like to the bridge. To, to your right is a shallow oyster bed, so kind of like if you go to the bridge and to your right, right in the middle. You see that you see that marker out there? Yeah. Cast right as, out that way as far as you can. Oh, yeah. Now, if you get too too far over to the left, there's hang ups towards the bridge, and about starting about 12, 15 feet out, there's hang ups. So you want to reel it in before you get in that close. Yeah, that's like our sails out there. Another little speck this morning. I think so. I don't think he's keeper, but I think he's a little bit healthier. Yeah, he's fatter. <laughs> Wish there was like a bunch of 15 inchers in here. He wants to come over there. I'll go over there and catch him. I think he got. I think he got a better chance of catching big ones over there near the yeah, near the oyster beds in that deep hole. See you, buddy. Awesome hooked up over there. We're catching sardines this morning, but hey, it's fun. Look, I'm talking to, about Austin catching the fish and I hook up. You must not have been holding your tongue right over here. <laughs> we catch them. <laughs> Doubled up over here. Doubles. Yeah, a little bit longer. We're getting there. Getting a little bigger. A little bit. That's what she said. Oh. 
hooked up at spot number two. Still trying out that finesse bullets and uh, four inch jerk shads and bad shad color. Little guy. My son didn't get a 20 inch in the cooler, but maybe you'll see that on his vid. Got a hard falling tide here. So I'm just throwing out kind of to the left. Letting that go all the way to the bottom. Bunch of blues in here too. Second keeper of the day. You lucky dog. <laughs> Austin's just over here getting the keepers. She got hooked up over there. Is that the one? Is that the trophy blue? Yeah, it's bluefish. Big old fat blue. Oh, quick release. Hooked up again. Oh, it's noisy out here with all this construction. Damn it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Well, we had some fun this morning anyway. Thanks for watching. Hope you all may have learned something. Using a little finesse Z-Mans today. This four inch baits on a finesse bullets. And it got the job done probably caught maybe between me and my son probably 60 fish this morning just had a good time my son put two in the cooler but you can probably see that on his page if you watch it hope you all have a good one thanks for watching